shoot another video here today with gears a little different look today uh, we're looking at from above the golfer let me take it up to the top here so you can see how it looks i've made the golfer transparent and turned on the bones feature of gears so we could see in a little more detail uh, how the body parts are working here it just makes it a little bit clearer how the segments are working as the golfer swings down so I wanted to highlight another lower body um, movement here from this above view and we're looking at here's his feet here's the top of his head and we're looking straight down on the golfer it's a little bit of a different perspective especially with without the golfer turned on actually let me turn him up a little bit here so you can see there there's the golfer I'm gonna make it a little more transparent and then let's look at the motion of the lower body with this tour player uh, as he takes it back and then into the ball so taking it back you're gonna see a little bit of rotation in the right thigh a right femur the left leg is gonna work a little bit inward and out so a little bit inward so internal rotation um, as he takes the club to the top so he's not really trying to keep his lower body perfectly still he's got some dynamic movement there as the right uh, side of his glute pushes back a little bit as he rotates the femur uh, rotates in slightly as he loads up to the top of his backswing here with his pivot now here's the move that I wanted to highlight and we did this in another video too with just the left leg but I wanted to show how the, the thighs or the femurs kind of work in tandem to help get the body more open. Uh, I think a lot of people just try to spin the hips, but it's important to get this left femur back over this foot, and then you're gonna see the right femur work as well, work in towards the left. So an impact, he's got this um, pelvis rotated. Uh, in this case, let's see if we can find it here. Pelvis rotation graph. Let's take a look. He is uh, impact. He's rotated open 42 degrees at this point. So pretty stand, common number. Kind of that would fall in the range of PGA Tour. But I think the, the the thing you miss out on when you're just looking at swings with video from just a face on or down the line angle you can't see really how much this these thighs are actually moving and the femurs have to move the right way a, a good feeling is that this left femur is rotating back over the foot and this leg maybe holds for just a second the right one and then the pelvis pulls the right leg in and the femur needs to be allowed to rotate don't glue your feet to the ground don't try to hold back go ahead and let this lower body rotate so you can get open not only with the hips you can also see the trunk and the thorax is opened up as well and he's at 27 degrees open with his upper body so um, thought that was a great way to, to see the lower body motion and kind of highlight how the the legs are rotating, not just hips, but the legs are rotating as well. And obviously they're connected, so they're going to rotate. But a lot of golfers will leave this left leg pinched in, and then this um, pelvis, the back side of the pelvis here, will back up toward the target, and there's no time to get open. So right from the top of the swing is the time to start doing work with your pelvis, getting it open, rotating the femurs and the thighs back toward the target, you can see how you end up getting nice and open at the ball. So hope that helps. Um, if you have any other questions or like to see another video, I'd be glad to, sh to do it for you. I'll leave a comment below. Click the like button if you like what I'm doing. And uh, we'll see you in the next video.